Welcome back, Aquarius. Hope you guys are doing fantastic. Hope you guys are doing well. I hope you guys are healthy and enjoying the good weather as the weather permits of course <laughs> as mother nature permits <laughs> okay so Aquarius this is gonna be the energies around you surround you or what's coming towards you so if you guys do resonate please be sure to like and if you guys do like please be sure to subscribe and if you have subscribed already, thank you so much. I appreciate you. And if you haven't, I think in the near future. I think in the near future. All right. Aquarius, thank you for your patience. This is going to be for... Aquarius. Aquarius, this is for you. Hmm. All right, two of wands at the bottom of the deck. <laughs> a little bit of ash in there. Okay. You guys could have a decision between, um, it could be between two people for some of you guys, or there could be like, some of you guys, hmm. Interesting. Somebody wants something stable with you guys. <laughs> Alright, let's see where this is going. Let's see where this is going. So, you guys could be dealing with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius or an... Oh, this could be you, Aquarius. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. And we also have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. also be distance between some of you guys you guys are looking like you're in, I don't know some of you guys could be in the energy of cutting out things that no longer serve you there could be some type of change as well with somebody oh wow look at that we have this king of wands coming out two times so there is possibly an Aries Leo Sagittarius or um, a masculine energy around and there you are again so we have the Queen of Swords two times and the King of Wands here two times. Those are the only kings and queens that are out so far. And here's that Knight of Pentacles. And the Knight of Pentacles is here. So there's a slow moving energy. There's a slow moving energy around. Um, I feel like it's between you and this king. It looks like... Okay, let's start over here. So it looks like there is an energy of this masculine person and there is there has been some type of change or there is some type of change. This king is a king of action. He's an action type king. Um, this king could also be somebody that is, you know, good looking, um, somebody that is attractive, busy. Um, I wouldn't say that this king could be like the most dependent king, but um, he is the king that he he he's a get things done kind of king. All right. Um, he could also be somebody that is. Um, 
what was I gonna say? Um, yeah, like attractive. For some of you guys, this could be a Leo. I'm getting strong Leo energy with the Sun and the King of Wands energy right here. But anyways, um, it looks like this person, there's been some type of change. And I feel like if some of you guys are not seeing eye to eye with this person. Or there could also be an energy of denial or... Um, yeah, like... Somebody's in regret. Like, I don't know if something was brought to the light with the sun card being here this person is still holding on some of you guys there could be maybe this person thinks that you're you're giving to somebody else or maybe this person regrets not giving you time not giving you energy um some of you guys there, there maybe somebody didn't feel valued okay some of you guys so you guys are holding back Super guarded energy. Very independent energy too. So some of you guys could have been, could have made yourself independent of this person. They could have made it th themselves independent of you. All right. Um, you guys are in a very cold energy. You guys are in an energy of cutting out things that no longer serve you. You or them. <laughs> but I'm assuming that this is you. Queen of Swords. There's an energy of guarding your heart, but then it's like your emotional fulfillment is here. And then it looks like you guys are moving towards calmer times and there's an energy of being heartbroken and disappointed. Maybe somebody was in and out. Maybe somebody wasn't reliable. Maybe somebody um, was a player. Um, some of you guys, there could be communication coming up with this person. Some of you guys, there's some type of truth and clarity. This person could be coming right literally towards you. So you guys, this person's coming forward with an apology. And then it looks like there is this slow moving energy. And it looks like it is this king. It's the same king from the king that we were starting with right here. And then it looks like somebody wants something new, something real, something tangible. Ace of Pentacles. And then it's, it looks like they're met with your energy, Queen of Swords. Well, I think Queen of Swords is Libra, but you know what I mean. Queen, the Swords energy. Five of Swords. <laughs> like, you guys are... Uh, I feel like you guys are not really... You guys are liberating yourself from this. Yeah, you guys are walking away. Some of you guys could be going towards something else. Some of you guys are just done with with these unreliable things. Ghosting the whole situation. Focusing on focusing on your stability, your pentacles, focusing on um you know material things. <laughs> That's what I feel like you guys are gonna be doing right now healing taking a break from the rest of that shit okay so yes slow moving energy i feel like there could be a lot of confusion there could be a lot of even options maybe for you but i feel like things are stuck things are not moving but i also feel like some of you guys are just literally like releasing the whole situation and finding healing yeah and i feel like there's gonna be growth there within your healing the, with that empress and the star card some of you guys this person some of you guys there's gonna be communication from this person and i feel like this person does want growth with you but some of you guys i, I don't know it's, it's honestly totally up to you guys what you guys want to do totally up to you all right aquarius Some of you guys were dealing with a false person. You do have marriage at the bottom of the deck. 
somebody does want some type something stable here some of you guys there's some type of good luck with some main male a change could be with a different person some of you guys there could be messaging as well honestly i really do feel um new energy for you guys but let's see what's going on here So, um, so somebody knows that, somebody knows, somebody's thinking, masculine energy, you know, they know what, what it is that they want. Um, this person does see you as above the rest. They do. They, they sense the distance. They know that there's a lot of distance. Okay. And I feel like there's perhaps some type of talk or something. I don't know if they're talking to people about the situation or if they want to talk to you. I feel like this person could possibly want to talk to you, but I feel like maybe there was even gossip for some of you guys around your whole situation. Um, some of you guys, this person, This person wants something with you. They, uh, I don't know. I feel like somebody, but somebody's just not in a good energy. Like, I feel like there, somebody is, somebody is disappointed. They're heartbroken. I think it's this main female. She's heartbroken over the whole situation. I don't know what happened. All right. But it, it's like, um, I don't know. There's a lot of distance. The, if this were to work, it's going to take a lot. That's what it looks like. It's going to take a lot. False person. Somebody wants to work on something. Somebody wants to work on getting together. You know, you know some, somebody wants, to, some of you guys have a kid for this person. Some of you guys, this person wants a kid with you they some this person wants a, a gift i don't know they're coming out as, as the false person though maybe this person has money maybe this person has money and some of you guys there's gonna be like temptation this devil card keeps poking out in this deck right here like he's, he keeps poking out like shoot are you guys gonna be tempted <laughs> some of you guys there could be a decision between two some of you guys, some of you guys, there's a, a, a good luck energy, like, you know, success and love and, you know, you have the big luck card here, like, it, I just feel like there could be something good here, but don't, there's an, also an energy that, like, you guys could possibly, like, just, I'm not gonna say you guys are gonna ruin it, I don't wanna say ruin it, that's not the right word. I just feel like you guys, you guys might expect that this person is on bullshit, but I honestly don't even feel like it's going to be that kind of energy. And I don't know if this is the new person or the old person. I want to say it's a new person. Okay. Because we have this false person right here. No, it's the old person. I'm sorry. Um, I said, is this the new person? I was just saying it to myself and it says the thievery. So it's definitely the false person. All right. Um, I don't know. They're going to try their luck. Unless, unless you're dealing with more than one false person. <laughs> I don't think so, though. The King of Wands came out twice. I think it is the same person. But some of you guys, uh, maybe there is something new here for you. <laughs> maybe you guys, you guys are ghosting the whole situation though. So I don't know. The person wants to make it right. 
legal matters. They want to make it right. Some of you guys, this person has legal issues. The person's going to try their luck, though. Long Road is here, too. There, it's going to take a lot, like I said. Because this person's not... They, I mean, they have marriage on their mind and whatever and whatnot. The house, a lot of money. Similar to Capricorn, to be honest with you. Um, and then even here, we have the Ten of Pentacles and the Ten of Cups. Like, uh, but... Uh, it's going to take a lot. And I don't know. if I feel like you guys are just not doing it. Like, Eight of Cups, Five of Pentacles... You guys, I don't know. <laughs> but it's totally up to you. What you guys want to do. Do you want to repeat a cycle? Do you want to do you want to learn the same lessons? Does this person really got what it takes? Got what it takes. Got what it takes. <laughs> do, do they? I don't know. <laughs> you guys are thinking about it. You guys are pondering like, I honestly don't know. Here's my emotions right there. Locked away. This is all I have left. And nobody gonna rob me of my joy. That's exactly what you guys are saying. <laughs> Straight up. As you should. Okay? As you should. So, what lessons have you guys learned already? From your situation. Are you guys repeating cycles? You think someone is lying. It's the it's the deceitful person. You guys need to stop sleeping so damn much. <laughs> Honestly, it's definitely you guys could have Capricorn in your chart. Shame, regret, guilt. Somebody has some shame. <laughs> Somebody has regret. Some of you guys also need to forgive, especially if there's a new energy that comes in. You guys don't want to push it away by holding on to that past, that past hurt. Okay, some of you guys are automatically even expecting things to fail with the new person because maybe you think all guys are the same. Maybe you think all girls are the same. All right. Get the fuck out of your head. Don't believe every shitty thought you have. Some of you guys need to relax, honestly. Some of you guys need to relax. I think, honestly, focusing on yourself is a good idea. Somebody does want something real, something stable with you. Um, I just, I wish that they came out with uh, maybe like the King of Pentacles or something like that. But anyways, they could be an Aries Leo Sagittarius. They could have it in their chart even. But remember, this is general. But anyways, I hope you guys were able to take something out of that and I'll see you guys next time, okay? All right, bye.